Hi guys, welcome to Everything Blockchain. Now it ain't a surprise that people are betting bid on crypto. There is just so much that the crypto world and the DeFi space in particular have to offer. And in today's video, I'm going to be talking about a platform that does exactly that. It's called Harvest Finance. But before I begin, I want to talk a little about yield farming. For those of you who don't know, yield farming helps users like you and me to earn passive income on our digital assets that would otherwise be sitting ideal in our wallets. It's the process of lending these assets to DeFi protocols so that the assets, or you can refer to it as the liquidity, can be utilized by others. Now, when you lend your assets or you add liquidity to a platform, you're rewarded with more cryptocurrency in the form of interest. But the catch is that there are a plethora of projects in the DeFi space that offer several liquidity incentives, each with their own set of rules and conditions, making it slightly complex. And what Harvest Finance does is it simplifies the task and lists all of these in one place and not just that, it collects or rather it harvests the reward tokens on behalf of the users and exchanges them for more of the underlying assets that the users deposit, thereby compounding the interest they earn. What this does is it saves users both time and network fees that are associated with making multiple transactions. And guys, time is money. So to put it simply, Harvest Finance is a yield aggregator that aggregates and automates the process of yield farming for its users. So without further ado, let's get started. We are going to click on Connect Wallet, choose the network. We have Ethereum, Binance Smart Chain, Polygon. It's only fair to mention the gains on Ethereum are massive. But for today, I'm going to be selecting Matic, Metamask, Internet. As soon as I'm connected, you can see you have the assets displayed on the left hand side. Then you have the harvest APY, the deposits and your balance. You also have the various liquidity pools at the top. Scroll down and you can see the entire list. I'm going to be selecting the Jarvis Euro USDC pool. Now you can hover on top of the vault details to see the vault address, pool address, the ABY. And if you look closely, you'll be able to see that 45.48% would be auto harvested for more ABY. 1.23% would be your wrapped matted rewards. And that makes it a total of 46.7% ABY. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to mint Jarvis Euro using USDC. Then we're going to provide liquidity on Kyber in the Jarvis Euro USDC pool. And eventually we will deposit the LP tokens on Harvest Finance. So all of this sounds like a lot, but let me take you through what Jarvis is is Jarvis Network is a set of protocols that gives users exposure to any trading instruments through synthetic assets or margin trading. It brings fiat stable coins like Euro, USD, etc. to the DeFi space through synthetic tokens called JFIATs. So I'm going to click on trade and let's get minting. We're going to enter the amount as our wallet is already connected. That's 50 USDC for which I'm getting 44.04 Jarvis Euro. And confirm. You can see the gas fees and the total amount. Click on confirm again and the transaction has started. Now that the transaction is complete, I'm going to go back to the Harvest Finance website and you can see here that I'm meant to click on Kyber DMM. Now Kyber DMM is DeFi's first dynamic automated market making protocol. It is a next generation automated market maker that is designed to maximize the use of capital by enabling extremely high capital efficiency and react into market conditions to optimize returns for liquidity providers like us. So 
since we clicked on the link directly, it brought us to the Jarvis Euro USDC pool. Now I'm going to click on maps. As you can see my balance is slightly more than $50 because I already had some in my wallet. Anyway, let's continue. Let's click on approve. You can see the gas fees on Marit are incomparable to the high gas fees you would have had to pay on the Ethereum network. Now you just want to click on confirm and proceed. So your USDC is approved. Click on approve again. Confirm again. And approved. We're going to click on supply. You will be able to review the details of your transaction as well as the LP tokens you're meant to receive. Wait for the confirmation, click on confirm and your transaction is submitted. Okay guys, as you can see over here, your current position, you have your LP token balance. Now what we are going to do is, like I mentioned at the start of the video, we are going to be depositing these LP tokens on Harvest Finance. So let's go back to Harvest Finance, click on the Jarvis Euro USDC pool. You can see your LP token balance, click on max and deposit. Make sure your state for rewards is stitched right. Wait for the approval, click on confirm and it's approved. Okay guys, in this step we are going to state all. So we click on it and we wait to grant permission by clicking on confirm. You will notice the approving is now staking, requires another approval. You can see the gas fees and the total, click on confirm. Wait for the staking to be completed. And there you have it. And look at this guys, I've already managed to earn Wrapped Matic. And you can see the total state here. So we managed to complete quite a few tasks today. We succeeded in minting Jarvis Euro using USDC. Then we provided liquidity on Tiber in the Jarvis Euro USDC pool. And used that LP token balance to deposit on Harvest. In case you have any questions regarding the entire process or anything else about the different protocols, you can reach out to me through the comment section and I will be happy to help. I'll see you another time with another video. Take care. Bye.